Section 1.3, Problem 48. In this section, you have a prop, you have a function, h of x, which is the eighth root of 2 plus absolute value of x. And you want to express this as f composed with g composed with h, the composition of three different functions. How do we go about doing this? The key here is to realize that this is really composed of three different pieces. What are you doing? Well, the first thing is you're taking the eighth root of something. That comes last, so that's going to represent f. What are you doing before that? Well, you're, at, you're adding 2 to whatever you have. So that's going to correspond to g. And then the initial thing that you do is what? You take the absolute value of something. So that's going to correspond to h. So then the claim is that f ought to equal the eighth root of x, g ought to equal 2 plus x, and h should just be absolute value of x. And let's see if this works. So if h is absolute value of x, what's g composed with h? What's well, 2 plus h of x, which is 2 plus absolute value of x. Now what about f composed with g composed with h? Well, this is f composed with the function g composed with h. So this is wherever you see x in f, you plug in h. So this is the eighth root of g composed with h. But we know what g composed with h is. It's 2 plus square root uh, absolute value of x. So this is then the eighth root of 2 plus the absolute value of x, which of course is h of x.